What is happening, bowlers? Chris Beans here with Bowlers Rant, bringing you another ball review from Storm Bowling. Okay, wanted to wait till the hype train was done till we take a look at the Storm Pro Motion. This is the new Belmo ball. It's in the Premier line um, and it's a benchmark reaction. And I was gonna completely skip it until I found out it was sanded, solid, and symmetrical. And those three things are always cool in the book of Chris Beans. So I uh, got a sweet deal from Dave Titer at Cat's Pro Shop. Thank you, Dave. And decided to punch this up and see what it was all about. Okay, let's cover the specs because that's what we do here at Bowler's Rant. It's got the Spec Reactive um, Solid Cover Stock, same one that was on the Crux Prime. Piston Weight Block, 2000 grit, Avalon finish, and it's steel blue. And it's got the Vanilla Snap Fragrance. Not sure what that's all about. It smells like soap, but whatever. And the number is at 15 pounds, 2.52 RG with 0.049 differential. This ball is really a master level control ball. You know, it's got the strength of the uh, phase two but the control like the iq tour um and and what they've done is they've really taken a ball that really doesn't overly respond to friction and gives you a finite level of control that most bowling balls don't give you and i really couldn't think of a better reaction for your collegiate bowler or your two-handed high rev high speed crowd the, and i'll explain it's like an analogy of a car right so you have automatic stick shifts most balls are automatics you can just come out of it at the bottom ball goes down hits the friction turns left and crack there's your strike this ball is not designed to do that this ball is designed to give you an accurate level of control that most bowling balls don't give you and so the first time i threw that ball i like to come up the back of the ball and then i watch the sail i was like maybe i under threw it and i did it again and watch the sail again i said okay and then I said, let me try to come up, come, you know, give it some access rotation. Then I watched it hit the break point, go bloop, and it hit the rack and destroyed it. And after playing with some, you know, hand positions, I realized that's exactly what this ball is about. It's about giving you a crazy amount of control uh, that will allow the ball to go through the rack with some authority, but it's going to go exactly where you tell it to. So if you were that player that has always wished you had a finer level of control and you've got a high amount of rev rate and you really like playing the break point in a very specific way or if you like to create uh, mixers, this is your ball, right? 400 plus crowd, you know, rev rate, this is your ball. Um, if you're a tweener or a stroker and you don't have a high amount of rev rate, you might have an, what you perceive to be an over under reaction, but that's because your shot making ability might not be consistent. So if you typically like 45 degrees and then the next shot, you throw it at like 10 degrees, you're probably going to get, you know, a very different reaction. You're going to say, oh, this ball's not doing it for me when it's really just the way you're throwing it. So this is not a ball meant for the casual bowler. I don't think this is a great house shot ball. This is a great tournament ball. Should respond well to surface changes. Uh, you could polish it up if you wanted or you know, hit it with a little more surface and take it down to 1,000 or 800 for the uh, superior conditions. And you know, have a, if it's provided that you're throwing it right, you should probably have a really good reaction. Uh, so again, uh, finite level of control. When it does go through the rack, if provided you throw it correctly on, on the right condition, uh, seems to do really well. Goes to the deck, lots of continuation, lots of control, does not jackknife sideways. So what do you think of this ball? Do you like the color? Do you like the reaction you're getting? Uh, have you shot any honor scores with it? Let me know, drop me a comment. Let's continue the conversation. Uh, more ball reviews are coming and until then, bow well. Subscribe, share on your Facebook feed.